performances in a way. Mm. Now, Colin Firth and Nicole Kidman have screen personas that are, in a mm. sense, for their audiences well known. Tell us a little bit about their off-screen personalities, how they, you know, the sorts of observations you had about them that maybe aren't consistent with what would, people would normally perceive of them. Well, you know, they're, they're, they're just incredibly normal people. You know, they're, they're, they're people who go about doing a job in a very passionate way. Um, and they're complex people, you know. They, 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 in, in doing the job properly, it requires an engagement on a level that, you know, maybe in other professions and other lives it doesn't require. It requires to also um, be quite open with your emotional landscape, um, which is, you know, in a, in a sense, both vulnerable and confronting. Um, and so, you know, uh, possibly their, 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 their celebrity, whatever you want to call it, st you know, um, personas are about protecting those things because, you know, that's a precious commodity for an actor. Um, and it's for their, for the work, not for the celebrity. Um, but away from that, you know, they're just incredibly warm. You know, Nicole is such a warm, uh, communicative person. You know, she's an Australian woman, you know, who um, who engages with the world and loves to engage with the people and, and, and incredibly professional. I mean, incredibly... Um, and, and very interested in doing, in this stage of her career, not that she hasn't previously, but very focused on doing um, complex, good work. Um, and so you, you, you kind of build up a, a sense of her just as a normal person going about, you know, what for her is a normal life. You know, I mean, you know, in, in the first sort of week or so of filming, we had, um, when we were doing quite a lot of train stuff, we had a, a large number of paparazzi following us around. And, and the, the hard thing is, is that, you know, in, in that context, it's very hard to, 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 to deal with, it was very hard to engage with the real person because that's, that's, a, that's a constant threat for her. Yeah. You know, and I already wanted Colin because he, um, you know, in the work that he's done previously, and particularly in recent films like Single Man and stuff like that, you know, incredible depth of uh, revealing the emotional landscape of a character. And, you know, this was a character who... Oh, shit, this is a character who doesn't speak, he doesn't talk. Um, and so, and what's also sort of remarkable about his performance is that he, as an actor, he doesn't even get to play what happened to him. You know, that's played by, a young, by Jeremy Irvine in the war years as, you know, as something different. So he had to build into his preparation, um, in a sense, the darkness for him to be able to access the emotion of it and the psych, psycholo psychological damage. Um, and you know, to do that, it takes you know real talent and real skill. And someone working with Colin was, you know, was kind of a revelation in a way. I mean, he was just so professional and just, but also incredibly engaging. He's someone who, um, you know, it was really important to have an actor of that substance um, involved. And you know, uh, when you go on a journey like that with an actor, you really, you know, you, it's more than just it's more than just sort of a professional relationship. You become friends. You become, you know, in a sense, you're sharing the the load in a way. Um, and for him, I know that it was a, you know, it was a great challenge to, to, to go to those dark places, um, as, it, as it was for both of us to, to bring them to the screen. And, you know, in a way, you, you, you don't want to, you, you want to share that with someone creatively. Um, and and what, I, what I find is that he's, he's a, as a person, he's incredibly inquisitive about everything um, and incredibly um, open to sort of exploring that inquisitiveness and um, you know that's the, when you when you're putting together a complex character that's a great process to be on yeah now his co-star